Alright guys, uh, today's going to be a little bit different of a video. I actually have a barbecue competition this weekend and I thought I'd bring y'all along. Y'all have seen Justin on some videos with me. Um, he's my teammate with Hickory Heat Barbecue. That's our catering company and competition team. I just thought I'd bring y'all along and show y'all a little bit behind the scenes. First stop, we just pulled up to Matador Meat and Wine. So let's get in here and get a couple things for the competition and then we'll keep rolling. Alright y'all, so we've left Matador Meat and Wine. Uh, before I do go to the barbecue competition, I'm going to actually be going to my son's baseball game. Uh, I coach his baseball team uh, along with a couple other coaches, my brother and then another coach named Coach Danny. Uh, but before we get to the competition, we're going to make a stop by the house and drop these uh, St. Louis style ribs off and the brisket off and then um, We'll be updating you a little bit at my son's game, and then we'll get to the competition. Hang tight I just thought since I'm bringing you all along on my day with the barbecue competition and everything I'd show you all what I got in the mail today Look forward to using these on the channel Alright guys, we're about to head over to my son's game. I'm going to bring you all along with and after that we'll swing back by the house, pick up some uh, items and materials for the barbecue competition and we'll get headed to Blue Ridge. Stick around. Give it a thumbs up. It's time to go to a barbecue competition, Zeusie. Time to go to a barbecue competition. Time to get loaded up. Show y'all a couple things. We've got two chickens me and Justin are going to make just for Pitmaster's privilege. We've got a pork butt in here that we're going to make just for eating on as well. And then we've got our Matador Meat and Wine USDA Prime brisket. A couple racks of Matador Meat and Wine St. Louis style ribs. And we're going to roll out after we get this packed up. Stay tuned. Alright guys, the baseball game's over. Y'all saw a little bit of footage there. Um, we're about to get loaded up and head over to Blue Ridge, Texas. My teammate Justin is already there. He staked out a spot for us. So y'all stay tuned and we'll get there. One's for lunch. <laughs> official. Is this official? Official. <laughs> official as can be.
y'all didn't have to cook all that for me. <laughs> right? But we did. Alright guys, it's been about seven hours on this front pork butt here, which is just for lunch. We figured we'd give y'all an update on everything. Wow. Look at that color. We're going to get these sprayed down and whenever we get them pulled off and everything off the smoker, we'll keep y'all updated. Oh, yeah. Little right. bit of we breakfast. Forgot, we forgot about our What's up, Mark? <laughs> <laughs> what up? Uh, this is going to be a hell of a cook. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the bin though. Oh, yeah. Just a little early morning breakfast for Hickory Heat Barbecue. What up, Justin? It's early. Early 30. Damn. We're going to keep y'all posted. This is just the beginning of a lot of barbecue. It's like once you pop the fun, don't stop. That's right. <laughs> Flavor Town. Oh yeah. There's that sunlight. <laughs> I'm about to go back to sleep on y'all. <laughs> yeah, it's almost beer 30 again. I know it. One or the other had to happen. <laughs> Fifty-one. Three. Oh. 
<laughs> that bark looks good. All right, guys, I told you I was going to keep y'all updated on the barbecue competition. We're just waiting on these ribs to finish up. Got my buddy Ed that's about to season up some of this chicken. Yeah, we got a little bit of uh, Big Ed's Hut Plucky Dust going on these chicken right here. And uh, some Cosmos Dirty Bird on the other. Yes, uh, both have great color. Yeah, both of them are coming along really good. Just sprayed them with a little apple cider and uh, covering them up with a little bit more seasoning. And we're oh, see flavor. Uh, we're gonna put some of this on this one. <laughs> Justin's gonna do it. Say what up? What's up, y'all? Beautiful day in Blue Ridge, Texas. Yes, sir. Couldn't have asked for better weather. What's up, Cody? What's up? You want to tell me what you're doing? I am barbecuing. Yeah, that's what, what I'm talking about. My name is my girl. Nice, that's what I'm talking about. Good job, dude. Nice. You sure you haven't done that before? Yeah. <laughs> Good job, dude. Getting our barbecue on. Y'all should be here. At the Sergio Garcia Memorial. That hickory heat just opened up, cut, cut up the ribs. They're straight up dickies. <laughs> <laughs> Just to give y'all a little peek. <laughs> Alright, so we're about to turn in brisket. What do we think about the brisket? A ten! A ten! Like river running. So we're back at it. Everybody say what's up. What's up? What's up? What up? Now, it's a little bit of pork butt action. Holy cow. I like the color of the bucket. This is a little bit better. A little bit of pork butt action. I cut, I cut the money muscle. It's got yeah. more of a honey brown. There you go.
about to add some burn-ins to this turn-in box and get her shut down and turned in. Thanks for following along on that barbecue competition guys, hope y'all liked it, it was a little bit different um, in comparison to the barbecue cook videos, um, but I just wanted to show y'all some behind the scenes, a uh, little bit about what goes on during these barbecue competitions, and then of course, you know, I brought y'all along for my day that day just to show you exactly what goes into it. Um, we were able to pull third place brisket out of 22 or 23 teams at the Sergio Garcia barbecue competition in 2018. So that was really awesome. We're happy. Um, got fourth overall out of those teams, so can't be, can't be too let down. But again, I appreciate y'all for watching. Um, if y'all like this kind of video, let me know by commenting down below. Um, and I'll keep putting them out for you if this is something you like. I appreciate y'all for following along. Um, before we get out of here though, wanted to show y'all a little addition I picked up this weekend at the barbecue competition. Got the North Texas Barbecue Addicts logo for the back porch from Big Phil Smokers. Um, that's actually the same logo on the hat there. If y'all aren't familiar with North Texas Barbecue Addicts, it's a page that I'm a part of on Facebook. Y'all go check them out. I'll put that inf information down below as well as Big Phil Smokers. But cheers to y'all. I appreciate y'all for following along. And again, if you like this kind of video, comment down below and I'll keep putting them out. But thanks for stopping by and I'll see y'all next time.